Hi, this is Michelle Cromer. This is your modern feng shui goddess tip of the week. And it is from Pat, a former student of mine over here at the University of Texas. Hello, Ms. Cromer. I have an important job interview coming up and I wondered if feng shui could help in any way. Thank you, Pat. Yes, 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 it can. We're standing at my front door because this is your life section and your career section of your home. So number one, Use your front door and make sure you have the five elements present. Like I have my jade plants for earth and I have metal in the, in the metal and I have wood door and I have the geraniums coming in as fire and I have water in my uh, mat. The second thing you're going to do is wear blue to the interview if you wanna calm your nerves or red if you wanna look and feel passionate. Or if you're like me, I would do both. The third thing you're gonna do is go to your helpful section of your home, which is the front right-hand corner. And I would put an icon there that reminds you of success. For me, it would be Lakshmi, the goddess of wealth and prosperity in the Hindu tradition. And the fourth thing that you're going to do is get a sheet of paper and write down what you're gonna wear the first day. And a to-do list, really bringing you in that present energy. And finally, have a desk at home, free of clutter, but have a desk where you can actually anchor that sort of energy. I have done offices where it's just willy-nilly, everybody's all over the place, but there's been some surveys done, recently posted in Inc.com, where people that don't have a desk feel lost. Good luck, Pat. This is Michelle Cromer. Ask me questions at michelle at michellecromer.com. Thanks, y'all.